For many fans, the latest season of 90 Day Fiancé doesn't have many heroes, but there are certainly a few villains who viewers simply can't stand. Though there was initially a lot of anticipation for the return of the AUG series, 90 Day Fiancé Season 9 has mostly disappointed so far. Many viewers have doubts about whether this season's storylines are genuine, and the cast members themselves aren't very compelling. Some Season 9 stars turned fans against them before they even made their 90 Day Fiancé debut. Once fans discovered Serbian newcomer Miona Bell's Instagram, she came under fire for blackfishing, and she was called out for her problematic makeup and styling. Miona is one of the rare franchise stars whose on-screen behavior actually made her more likable because she's been far less offensive on the show. Dot but the same cannot be said for several of Miona's castmates. 90 Day Fiancé Season 9 features numerous new stars whose on-screen behavior has gotten them on viewers' bad side. It finally feels as though the season is gaining momentum, and many in the cast have already made a bad impression on the audience for the way they treat their partners. Some of them are already feeling the heat from fans on social media who are accusing them of being villains. Emily Beebley. Though Emily Beebley isn't as bad as some of the all time worst villains in the franchise, many viewers are furious at her for the way she behaves with her fiance Kobe Blaze. Fans sympathized with how difficult it was for Kobe to go without seeing his son Coben for the first several months of his life. So when Emily criticizes Kobe's parenting skills and tries to control his relationship with their son, she alienates viewers. Emily has received a flood of criticism on social media, and it seems she never expected such an extreme backlash. Bilal Hazias. Bilal Hazias got on fans' nerves early on this season when he decided to prank his fiancée Shaida Sween when she first arrived in the U. S viewers' opinion of Bilal has only gotten worse since then, and he's been called out for being a hypocrite. Though he gleefully tricked Shida, a playful tap from her in the car was all it took for him to throw a tantrum. 90 Day Fiancé fans have also accused Bilal of leading Shida on regarding her desire to have children, and he's easily one of the least liked stars this season. Kara Base. Kara Base wasn't instantly vilified the way Emily and Bilal were, but in recent episodes the 90 Day Fiancé star's likability has tanked. Fans have begun picking up on her controlling nature and the way she talks down to her fiancé Guillermo Roger. In a new episode, after constructing a balloon installation Guillermo spoke about gifting their leftover balloons to some children and Cara responded by forcefully popping said balloons. That was all viewers needed to label Cara a villain. Dot because 90 Day Fiancé Season 9 is still in its early episodes, Emily, Bilal, and Cara are just starting to get a taste of fans' criticism, which is likely to get worse as the season progresses. Though it's possible that one or all of them could turn things around on the show and redeem their earlier behavior, it's unlikely. It's far more probable that they'll join the likes of Big Ed Brown, Mike Burke, and Angela Deem as some of the most despised cast members in the franchise.